Hello everyone and welcome to the Trade Ideas Live Trading Room Recap for Thursday, February the 6th. My name is Barry Anderson, moderator of your trading room. Any questions you may have for me, you can use this email address and this is a link to get into our free room, 100% free. You do not have to be a member of Trade Ideas to be in our free room. And the room is open between 9 and 3 Eastern Time. I share my screen, I'm live on the mic. And uh, Monday to Friday, of course, not Saturday and Sunday. And in the email you're getting, there is still time to sign up for the test drive. The test drive is on. Uh, this is the fourth day of it. You can still sign up. It will cost you $8.99. You'll get six trading days, basically, starting tomorrow, uh, Friday, and then all next week. For $8.99, you'll experience the full premium service. If you are a standard subscriber right now, you can upgrade for those six days uh, to the premium service. Once the drive is over, it's over. Nothing for you to do. You don't have to unsubscribe. Uh, if we upgraded you from standard to premium, you'll go back to standard. And of course, we'll offer a pretty nice discount, a promo code, once the test drive is over, if you do want to take out a subscription. So um, again, because I'm in the test drive, a lot of questions and not able to really concentrate too much on trading, but I was able to take this Sono trade. Now it was interesting. Uh, this came from the AI, also came from my watch list um, that I have. And where did it come from in the AI? Let me see it. There we are, Sono. Now it, it triggered at 16.09, okay? You can see, it was right there. But I, as I said in the room, you know, I don't like to take trades in the first 15 minutes. And you can see that right here, it, it came in at 9.35, five minutes after the market opened. Now, I let it settle down a little bit. And I ended up, I think I ended up taking trade, I believe it was probably on, on this candle right there. But as I said, you know, I, it popped up all the way to 6.89. In fact, it must have been, on, it must have been, because I got into this trade at, Actually, it was 16.52, so I guess I got in on that candle. So that was the, so that's right. So I did wait the first 15. I got in on that candle. It pulled back a little bit, and then I, 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 I was saying in the room, I'd like to see a bid of at least 16.50. I got the bid at 16.50. I took it at 16.52. It popped up almost immediately to 16.89. Um, love to say I, <coughs> excuse me, sold every, <coughs> excuse me, I sold everything up there, but. Not quite. I got out at 16.82 and I think it was at 16.68. Uh, so a little bit. And then of course, I'm answering questions in the room. So very difficult for me to concentrate on trading anymore uh, for the balance of the day. But this was certainly a, a, a nice early one. Uh, it came in my, my window right there at 16.59. So a little bit later than the AI. Well, a lot later than the AI, but I wouldn't have taken it that early anyway. I just find that things, I mean, in this particular case, it kept going. I just find, find that in the first 15 minutes, you can see horrible action, you know, up, down, up, down. So, you know, if you're putting, if you are putting stops in place, you know, it's pretty tough. It's pretty tough to, um, you know, to figure out what you want to do. I mean, here the stop was at the low of the day, which is, you know, pretty, that's a pretty uh, big stop. Uh, that's what the AI was saying pretty big stop. That's about a dollar, a little less than a dollar on a $16 stock. So, you know, it's a pretty big stop. But anyway, I just wanted to show you that. Um, also, I was talking about yesterday how the re-entries. Um, so there's Peloton, P-T-O-N. It actually got stopped out. This was a short, okay? So there was the alert on that candle and then it moved up and it actually got stopped out. And then as I explained yesterday, all of these re-entry prices are automatically calculated right at the time of the alert because all they are is halfway between the entry and the stop. Okay, so they're automatically calculated. The only time they trigger, and you'll know it triggers if you have the re-entry uh, uh, time column up, you'll, these are the only ones that triggered. And why does it trigger? Well, first, it doesn't have to actually get stopped out as an exit reason, but if the stock, for instance, here, and let, let me just show you this one. So, so B, uh, BLL, okay? See, it actually got out on a profit save. It didn't actually take the stop hit to get out, but later on, it actually hit the stop price. You see? It actually, see how it came down? Hit the stop price. Then it got back to this halfway between where is it, the bill? Halfway between the 76, uh, 74 
and the 7550, which was 7612, and it took and it took the trade. Okay, or it alerted you. So in this particular case, not bad. I mean, you know, it's 7612 re-entry and 7674 right now. So that's not too bad. The Peloton for me is is nicer because it's it's a bigger percentage move. 2669, 2915 right now. Remember, this is a this is a short. Okay, so this is a short sell. And the other one I think is what was a buyout. So I I I, I didn't really count that one. Yeah, this is a buyout at 33.44. So, you know, I would just disregard that. So, so again, like yesterday, we had a couple that were very nice on the on the re-entries, and again today, a couple that are that are uh, you know pretty good, especially the Peloton on the on a percentage basis, going from 29.69 right now 29.16. So again, another way to use the AI. You know, there's all sorts of ways you can use the AI. If you find that at the beginning, you know, you're just getting too many trades at once. Uh, too many things to look at at once. Uh, you know, all you, sometimes all you really have to do is just keep an eye on this and see when there's a re-entry. And we usually, I mean, yesterday I think we had two. Uh, today we've got three of them. Some days you may not get any. You know, it, it's, it's, it's all math. So you may not get any, but it might be a great idea just to concentrate on these, especially if you're just, you know, um, uh, testing the AI out uh, at the beginning just to see what, how, how it works. So let's put it back here on the other monitor. I want to get back into the room. Lots and lots of questions. It's been a great test drive. We have had, uh, we're almost up to 2,000 people in the test drive. So, and, and we'll still have more uh, coming. So uh, for the balance of say, for tomorrow and next week. So if you have any questions, you have any questions, this is the, whoop, there was, oh, so this, this is a, an IPO. It's an IPO today. So it just took out the high. See what happens when I get back into the room. Um, have any questions for me? This is the email address you can use. This is a link for our free room. I'll open the room tomorrow at 9 o'clock. And uh, hope, to have a, hope you have a great evening. We'll see you then. Bye-bye.